Hey there, Gemini. Welcome to Healing Guys Tarot. This is going to be a reading for when you ever you happen to come across it. And that will be when you're meant to see it. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Look, it's popping out already. And we have Mystic Healer. Healing energy flows through you. And it also came out sideways. So I think this could come through at you at any time. I feel like you, sometimes it comes through and you're not expecting it. If you are a healer, all of a sudden, if you, you know, you Reiki, any kind of energy work, all of a sudden your hands might get hot. Or, or you might just all of a sudden feel something going through you, like a vibration. I don't know if you're aware of this, but uh, why this is happening. But it's, it's saying that you are a mystic healer here. Oh, joy and delight. Open your heart to joy. So, what else we have here for you guys? But that really wanted to fly out right away. So I was meant to know this. And also fertility. So you're very fertile at this time. So this is like having the Empress energy. So anything you put your your energy into is um, really going to take off. And being next to the Mystic Healer, that's really amazing. That even gives it more it's stronger, is more power. Um, also, if you're want to start a family it's a good time to start a family You're very fertile start a new business start something new start a new project it's a very good time and I think what whatever you're working on you're gonna have the healing energy to help you move this along and um, someone might be grieving but there's a transformation here and this could be healing too for the grieving if you're if you're um or you can help people who are grieving with your healing energy Confidence is your key to success. New Moon and Leo. Okay, so right now while I'm doing this reading, we are in Leo season. So it's very strong, very healing. It's it's giving you strength and I think you're able to give other people strength. Your um, energy is empowering. Very exciting and also very protective. I feel like you see through things. You have a, a wisdom that is um, unsurpassed by others is 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 something that you can you have a deep knowing uh, a way to just really connect with others and also connect with nature and animals and we have you are good enough so if you're worried about something a new moon in Virgo which is going to be you know Virgo's next sign coming up too so it's like you're moving into this energy you have confidence and you are good enough so don't forget that okay let's see when that's your general energy now let's see what's falling into place for you okay so now we right now we're at worry and anxiety so let me um get some clarifying cards on that because this is what's falling into place for you. Okay, let's clear this up. You can't sleep at night and worry about something here. Okay, so you're you see you're coming into your power. It's emperor energy, and you're um also able to manifest things to um. You're worried about the competition. That's why it's like um, you are good enough. This this worry is going to be going away. This worry about this competition or struggling or or arguing with others because you are the emperor here. It could also represent an Aries. And we have the Queen of Pentacles with Virgo, um, Taurus, and Capricorn. Um, this this is you're just able to um, I think bring into your focus um anything that you need to accomplish i it, it's like weird this is the emperor but it almost feels like a magician energy to me when i'm reading these cards together right now the energy is coming across is that you're able to produce things like almost like out of nowhere it's it's like you have the capability of just like say if you also you need you're short on some money you'll just go in your pocket pock your handbag or whatever and just pull out the money it's just it's just there it, I'm, it's really weird I'm seeing something really strange here but it's you're able to um, 
even like with the home or the or the earth it's like there's a connection a very strong connection to nature i'm feeling here with you and you're in power or um you might be someone that has a a job of power or authority whatever you do for your career there's a lot of authority behind this also we have the knight of wands in here this is um aries leo sagittarius and um this might be energy that's coming in towards you let's see okay now what will be arriving soon an offer a gift something will be coming towards you it could be um someone bringing a gift bringing off bringing advice even bringing some information but there's something coming towards you that's going to help you let's clarify this Ooh, yeah this is going to shock you whatever this is that's coming towards you <clears throat> is going to shock you You're not going to expect it it's going to be a surprise someone might be telling you they're obsessing over you or that they're or this this whatever is coming toward you is going to be um something that that's actually been a burden it's it's and it's going to be rectified something's going to you're going to be getting some kind of offer to get rid of this burden whatever this is that you maybe been doing too much um someone could be offering you help if you've been overindulging in something there might be help coming your way or it's something but it's like this worrying about what you lost here and not seeing this capability is is it's going to change things are shocking change there's something just is going to come out of the blue and just really help you here it could be a new job that changes everything for you that gets you away from this energy here this could be something that changes your life so much that it brings gets you away from your current circumstances or people you hang out with or something like that that really makes a big difference in your life okay what will be leaving okay these want to come up okay see the devil and this being alone so this is leaving you this devil energy which is here this is this is taking care of this energy and so the devil capricorn energy could be a capricorn too and virgo energy so this feeling alone and um and overdoing or or being addicted to something or something is leaving I'll clarify these it's going to balance you out it feels like you're getting help. I almost feel like you're getting spiritual help here. Um, you have the Empress here. This is, you're able to, um, see that's why I felt like this. I feel like the Empress energy here too with, here, with this and um, also fertility. So a very strong Empress energy feeling for you. Um, this call also represent a Taurus or a Libra, but I feel it's your energy. And here we have Taurus with the Hierophant here. This is help um, spiritually. I think you're spiritually connected and you're getting um, the help you need here to balance everything else, to make things come into together the way you need things to, to sort of like things to meet. They weren't meeting before and now they're going to meet for you. They're going to balance things out. You're going to be able to make a decision. There's a decision you were um, trying to make and you weren't sure what to do. You're going to be able to make it now because you're getting spiritually guided. This also could be something coming from an um, official place, an uh, institution, but this is going to help you get rid of this energy that it's leaving you now because you're getting, you're getting supported, you're getting help. And with you being the Empress, you know, you're able to create whatever you need to create. So that's what's coming in to, to chase this away, to help you get rid of this. Okay, what will be returning? Ooh, there's going to be an offer here. Money's coming in. Financially, there's going to be something, maybe a new job, a new situation, 
a new opportunity and it's also coming into partnership lovers and this is your card gemini so you're coming into your reading so this this is awesome maybe it's also saying that you're going to be come back to yourself because it feels like you left yourself for a while like you were in another uh, energy another environment that wasn't good for you and now you're getting out of that because you're getting it divinely helped okay let's um clarify the ace of pentacles here and also could be a lover coming back in for you okay pisces energy seeing things in a new perspective also um a good opportunity now here with oh i'm liking this yeah so you're going to be um a getting money that maybe you weren't getting an even um pay before or something now you're gonna you're gonna get paid for the work you do you're also gonna be um single if you weren't single you're gonna be single or you're gonna be um, able to handle everything on your own because you're gonna be independently wealthy i'm feeling really a lot of money coming in for you and there's gonna be communication this is gonna happen quickly once you shift and you get out of this energy here and um, this energy leaves you, whatever this was, this toxic environment or just toxic energy, whatever this thing was here that um, you had to leave, this is going to change for you. This is going to be really good. Communication coming in really quickly. Moving quickly. Also could be, you know, your soulmate here, the lovers, the twin flame. Let's see what else we have here for Gemini. yeah here we have the five of cups so this is coming up again here that you're thinking about what you lost or someone could be thinking about what they lost with you and not seeing a possibility with these other two cups here but yeah someone's missing you might be someone coming back here someone's thinking about you day and night and you are you stick up you you stand out above the rest I'm having a really hard time talking here. I'm sorry. Seven of Wands. Um, a lot of passion here. I feel like you're getting noticed. King of Pentacles. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. I think you're doing quite well financially. Now we have the Queen and King. You could be uh, this person that you're, you're partner here could be financially stable too. And it could be a good partnership power couple new beginnings Aquarius or Libra energy starting something new taking a leap of faith might be with this king of pentacles walking away from the burdens because you're starting something brand new you're saying I had enough of this you're leaving it oops wow okay so this card yeah someone's coming in with an offer here um could be a Scorpio, um, Cancer, Pisces doesn't have to be. They might even be coming with apology. They they want to. There's something that ended. They might want to bring back around and work on this because we have transition here. We have Scorpio energy. You have um, death and rebirth. And here is trying to make things work. Trying to um, work as a team. Maybe that wasn't happening before. Love, yeah, Ace of Cups. A lot of love here. So it really looks good for um, a relationship here got the lovers you have the ace of cups i'm liking it overflowing with love a lot of emotions here very a lot of happiness come in for you the moon so this could be something might be hidden the, this person's emotions i think is high and this person that thinks a lot about you i don't think they're letting you know how much they really care but they do they care enormously And here you're going to be victorious. Whatever you're working on, whatever you're doing in business, or you're going to be in this, you could be become famous, you're in the spotlight, you're getting attention. You're getting noticed. You're getting recognition. And you might be stuck in your head about something, mentally being conflicted, but you can get out of that. This is you looking at yourself saying, why am I stuck in my head about it? Things are not that bad. You're looking at yourself saying, what is going on here? Why am I so worried about this? It's going to all work out. Yeah, the Nine of Swords. It's like you're worried about something here. And we have it to here, the Nine of Swords. And that's what they say, fall into place. This is, um, you worry about something that's going to all work out. And you got the King of Wands. So you have a lot of, um, a lot of passion here. This Leo energy, 
could also be an Aries or a Sagittarius but there's there might be this person coming towards you or it might be you starting something new or maybe becoming a boss or being in charge or something a lot of and you have a lot of passion for this and the Knight of Wands okay the Knight of Wands that that's someone's coming toward you could be a playboy playgirl I uh, want to have some fun and they might be in and out so watch that a little bit and you'll know and the ace of pentacles yes money's coming in for your finances are going to really be good you're getting the opportunity here with um the ace of pentacles we have it here too so it's coming up twice for you so i said there's definitely going kind of job and and money opportunities coming in and all looks well here and it's gonna um work out looks really good one more and then we'll close this off queen of cups Yes, people see you as very loving, nurturing, caring, and very intuitive. So I feel like that's your energy that you're you have right now, especially being a healer, and that makes a lot of sense. And you also have temperance here, Sagittarius energy. Things are going to balance out for you. Things didn't feel balanced. They are going to start balancing out. Things are starting to go in your favor. I think if they weren't, it's going to happen now. Things are just shifting and changing, and someone definitely wants to come back. And um. Yeah, this is going to be a love here, a love offer coming in, and maybe even an apology. All right, um, Gemini, I hope you like this reading. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I hope to see you again real soon. Thank you.